Hey hello guys welcome to chess the bada and today in this video we are going to see an uh, interesting trap which is known as uh, ponziani trap so let's start the game e4 e5 knight to f3 knight to c6 so these uh, these are all very standard chess opening theory and from here we we'll go for c3 knight to f6 attacking this white pawn we will just leave that and uh, go for d4 so definitely it's a free pawn black will take this and from here we will push this pawn further so from here uh, black has three option one is knight to here and the other is knight to here and the other one is knight to here so we'll try this one first knight to a5 then b4 completely traps this black knight so he won't go there so this one is completely a waste of move so the only option left for black is knight to e7 then you can take this pawn knight to e5 so from here you can see this is weird setup three knights in a single e file so this will completely disturb him because this pawn is vulnerable here he will try to push this pawn further d6 so if you play this one then definitely it's it's advantage for us we can set a trap from here bishop to b5 giving check to this king so from here we can see all the option c6 and then from here you can uh, take this knight so if you take this means then it is it's a easy for us we can take this pawn at uh, b7 so it's a open check here and uh, king takes this light square bishop and from here we'll get a queen so check from here and uh, I to c8 blocking this check and uh, check and king takes the queen at d7 so from here we can see it's it's uh, easy win for us because we are having a full piece queen and uh, setup is completely winning for us so we can see the other options from here if we push this light square bishop means then we can take it and uh, the queen is completely lost and it's a uh, easy win for us so after this one what if he plays uh, here pawn takes uh, c6 and uh, pawn take here then knight to c6 and if the knight takes the white knight at c6 means in, and it's completely uh, fork here pinning the king knight and uh, rook so it's from here it's it should be a easy win for us so i will check another thing what if he plays knight to g6 then just go for uh, bishop to g, uh, d3 so if he is not cautious means definitely he will think like every uh, like what uh, definitely we are going to lose this knight so what if we take this pawn and uh, disturb the king's castling so then we can easily set an another trap from here that is uh, bishop takes the knight at g6 if he is greedy means definitely he can go for uh, this queen then we can give check from here we can take this king till this this file king to e7 and give a check with this bishop g5 and king to d6 uh, no hurry in picking up this queen definitely the queen is ours so from here uh, can give check king to c5 and uh, can support this knight with this knight so no worries if we take this bishop means then uh, pawn to b4 is, is completely uh, checkmate 
so if we place uh, pawn to a6 then no worries you can take this queen and see uh, from here the position is uh, much advantage for us and also uh, we are up by a uh, whole piece and this knight is already trapped here so from here it should be a easy win for us so now it's puzzle time so solve this puzzle uh, what you have to do means uh, mate in 3 for white comment your answers in the comment box and uh, if it is correct means I will give you a hot do subscribe and like the video and also share with your friends thank you and I will meet you in another useful video thank you and bye